stop recording. Nick Gage. Nick effing Gage. What a tandem. You know, the last show we talked about B-Boy being an independent wrestling legend who's done it all, who's seen it all. Nick Gage could also be put in that category. Nick effing Gage, the man, the first ever CZW heavyweight champion, a four-time CZW champion, a man who's wrestled them all in the business, a true icon in the world of professional wrestling and also violent professional wrestling. Absolutely, yeah, and Jimmy Lloyd, he looked up to Nick Gage as a kid, you know. This is really a dream scenario for him, to get to stand in the ring, teaming with an idol of his. Jason Saint. What does Jason Saint want? I have purchased for Horror Show. Is now, I guess, the manager for the Faces of Fear. Ming and the Barbarian. What, what more trick can be said about the Faces of Fear? They were one of the hottest tag teams at WCW from 96 to 99. They're former members of the Heenan family, where they were managed by Bobby the Brain Heenan. Uh, they competed at WrestleMania 7 against the Rockers. Uh, in the past, they've had their differences. Barbarian has twice turned on Ming, once in 98, once in 99, but here they are, side by side, ready to go to war. Jason Saint, I present to you the team of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Kirby has warned the audience that this match may not be appropriate for children. Oh no, no, this is gonna get downright ugly and vicious. I mean, look, we all know the history of Ming and the Barbarian. If you know professional wrestling, you know that Barbarian and, and Ming have some horror stories about bar fights and incidents of being the two most intimidating res wrestling individuals of all time. If you go up and you ask a wrestler, who's the baddest guy in the back? Who's the guy you don't want to get into a fight with? Who's the guy you don't want to accidentally spill a drink on? Ming comes to mind every time. Haku comes to mind every time. The Barbarian comes to mind every time. But on the other end, when you talk about dangerous men, you also talk about Nick Gage. I mean, look, it's no secret, and I'm not gonna go into details about it, but the man was on a five-year hiatus from professional wrestling due to, uh, let's just say, personal demons. If you Google the situation, you'll read all about it. But Nick Gage, he's a dangerous, dangerous man. He's willing to sink, <clears throat> I'm sorry, he's willing to sink to any depths necessary to attain victory. He lives his life by three words, murder, death, kill. Uh, I mean, that just sums it up right there. Well, I mean, if that's your attitude, if those are the three rules you live by, you got to bring them all to the table here because Ming and the Barbarian are going to give you everything they got. A couple stiff chops there from the Barbarian on Jimmy Lloyd. Jimmy Lloyd thought he was going to be able to get one over on Barbarian. Barbarian shot him right back into the corner. Jimmy Lloyd ducked, gets out of the way. Oh. Huge running clothesline to the corner on Barbarian. Another huge running clothesline from Jimmy Lloyd. And Jimmy Lloyd feeling it right now. What a moment for Jimmy Lloyd again. 
grew up idolizing Nick Gage. He got the Barbarian off his feet. And now, yes, to get the Barbarian off his feet. And here's what everybody wants to see. They want to see Ming. They want to see Nick Gage. They want to see brutality at its finest. Did you ever think, Nick, that you would see a moment like this, a stare down between Ming and Nick F. and Gage? I did not, Greg. Of all the things I could have predicted seeing in my long career here in professional wrestling, seeing these two go head to head, it really is just like something out of a video game. And they're trading and back shots and back and forth. Absolutely. Oh my God, there's a patented Ming chop right to the chest of Nick Gage. And Nick Gage, what? with a knee of his own to the chest of Ming right there. Ming throwing blows of his own. And Ming. Oh! Huge hit from Ming! A huge hit from Ming. Bullet club in the house. Barbarian lays out Nick Gage on the outside. Jimmy Lloyd's unsure what to do. I mean, he's got the least experience out of all these guys. Suicide dive. Suicide dive to the outside. As Jimmy Lloyd takes out not only Barbarian. Well, this is breaking down real quick. And look at the ref, he doesn't know what to do. You know who we need right now? It's Jimmy Lloyd asking the referee to chop. Hey, you better move. You better move. That's just a bad decision. Yeah, we got, we got all these men here on the outside right now. Get this ref out of here. We need a real ref like Tommy Young. Barbarian getting help by Jimmy Lloyd. Jimmy Lloyd saying, let's dish out some chops now. I see on the other end, I see me and Nick Gage just wail and beat the holy hell out of each other. Wrestling fans thought they never had the chance to give a chop to Barbarian. I, I feel like that's a bad life decision to chop Barbarian. He's probably going to take a list of names after this. I wouldn't want to be around when he finds out how to track each one of these fans down. Ming on the outside with Nick Gage. Looks to try to throw him in. Nick Gage blocks him. And some managing skills that oh Jason Saint has. Ming getting thrown. And the chairs have come out. Jimmy Lloyd on the outside. Corner. Right to the cut, Ming and Nick Gage battling Jimmy Lloyd's got Barbarian in the other corner. Another stiff steel chair shot to Ming from Nick Gage. And he's not feeling any pain. I think it just woke Ming up. Barbarian getting pissed off on his own right here as he throws Jimmy Lloyd into the corner. Barbarian's got a steel chair. I'd like to make it clear this match is not no disqualification. Well, it appears to be. As Barbarian levels Jimmy the outside and we got ourselves a battle of the highest order Nick Gage tries to run into Ming gets sidestepped and Ming tosses Nick Gage into the ring barrier Barbarian now pitching Jimmy Lloyd out to the fans Ming with a steel chair shot to Nick Gage another steel chair shot to a third steel shot chair shot to Nick Gage right to the Fourth skull chair shot, and we have complete pandemonium outside the ring this is chaos. Absolute chaos out amongst the Black Label Pro Faithful. As we've got Ming sidestepping, trying to... Barbarian and, and Jimmy Lloyd still on the outside, battling amongst the fans. Oh my, I see the ring light shaking. This is not good. I'm trying to keep my eyes on the action right now as I see a piece of Nick Gage right now. Tracking Ming through the crowd right now, trying to inflict more pain. I hear in the distance Jimmy Lloyd and Barbarian doing damage. I, I, I hear again over here Nick Gage and Ming. The chaos just going on all around us right now. Ming seems to have the upper hand on Nick.
Nick Gage in the far right corner of the Black Label Pro Arena, Barbarian and Jimmy Lloyd in the far left corner. You know, I can't see much of anything, but if this keeps up, we're going to be finding pieces of these four guys everywhere around this building. Absolutely. Faces of fear, the toenails of justice strewn about here. They're probably going to get ripped from their bodies. Ugh. Barbarian and Jimmy Lloyd, and again, it, it appears in the distance that these men brutally still going after each other. Nick Gage getting thrown to the ground by Ming. Ming, Ming has a steel chair, it looks like. It's uh, nice to hear that the crowd listened to the no swearing rule. Yes, absolutely. I see Barbarian now parting the ways of the fans in control. Moving chairs are always reorganizing the chairs. I don't know what he's got set up here for Jimmy Lloyd. Ming and, and we have literally two hardcore brawls going on in different parts of the arena right now. Jimmy Lloyd and Barbarian. Jimmy Lloyd. Barbarian throwing Jimmy Lloyd head first into a whole row, several rows of chairs. And there goes Ming, Nick Gage, finally trying to get this back under control for him and Jimmy Lloyd. Jimmy Lloyd now also trying to throw forearms to Barbarian. Barbarian proving to be a little bit more competition than Nick Gage. Oh, no, 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 don't come over here. I'm going to get myself. And Nick Gage right now next to me. Nick Gage right next to us. Oh, God. Oh, don't ruin my t-shirts. Oh, come on. And Ming right now grabbing that steel chair. I got gimmick set and up. My o, right onto the shoulder of Nick Gage. Oh, God. Oh, right across the back. Ow. This is one of the most vicious men in all of pro wrestling history. And they're waiting over by us. Right now on Nick Gage. We're getting up close personal with this. Shut the hell up. Beat his ass, too. Beat his ass. Look, when Ming tells you to shut up, you shut up, Nick. I'm going to try to keep my voice down here as Nick Gage. And what is Nick Gage going to do to Ming? Ming gets thrown into more tables, more chairs. Nick Gage getting into a pushing match with some of the fans right now. Have completely lost track of where the Barbarian and Jimmy Lloyd are in this room right now. Nick up, there they are. Now, all, all four competitors now within a, a vicinity of each other. The referee gonna try to get some order going in the chaos here as Ming gets thrown back into the ring by Nick Gage. And Nick Gage and Ming, the first two to make it in. Barbarian there, Jimmy Lloyd also back. The fans trying to collect their chairs and get a seat here to finish up the match. Is my mic on? I think I was out for a second here. I'm sorry. This is out of control. You're good. And we have all four men back in the ring. What an explosive brawl here to end Black Label Pro Darkest Timeline Championship Tournament Phase 2. Nick Gage and Jimmy Lloyd. I gotta say, this match has surpassed everyone's expectations here. I mean, Ming and the Barbarian have never looked better. Barbarian, Ming! Dual choke slam! Double choke slam! Dual choke slam! What a matchup. Barbarian have never looked more brutal. I gotta say, this surpasses my favorite Ming match, which was with Hacksaw Jim Duggan at Uncensored 95 in a martial arts match. This is everything and more than I expected. Nick Age up and over Ming on over his shoulder. What a head by Christ almighty! is definitely wins in there. I wouldn't be surprised if Nick Gage didn't. I, I'm shocked he got the three count. I didn't get the three count there. Nick Gage has suffered harder times than this, if you know what I'm saying. All right, Nick Gage finally to his seat. Feet. Ming picking him up. Rib breaker. Nick Gage kicks out. Everyone in the Black Label Pro Arena here on their feet. 
And what does Ming have in store? Jimmy Lloyd pulling Ming to the outside of the ring. Jimmy Lloyd now brawling with the with Ming on the outside. Tossing him head first into the ring post. I can't even follow this now anymore. On his feet. He's gonna make a run here at Nick Gage, it looks like. Nick Gage ready for him. Push him into the corner. Big forearms. Another big flying forearm into the corner. And what is Nick Gage gonna be going for here? Oh, and the referee is taken down. Good, good. Now let's bring out Tommy Young. What a boot from Barbarian. Jimmy Lloyd comes in. And spear. A spear. A spear. Faces of fears. Bye bye, Jason Saint. Jason Saint, gone. Jimmy Lloyd gets caught by Bing on the outside. I think he's got him in the Tongan Tongan death, death grip. Yes, Tongan death grip for sure. Barbarian gets kicked into lower solar plexus. DDT. The DDT. The referee. Whoa! Yes, she wrote. What an incredible. Somebody ring the bell. What a brawl that was. Wow. Nick Gage and Jimmy Lloyd coming together to take on childhood heroes. Darkest Timeline Championship Tournament. What incredible action we've seen here tonight. What a Next night. We're going to be back. We got AJ Gray taking on Filthy Tom Lawler. We got Darby Allen taking on Sammy Guevara. And we got me and Gregory Iron. We'll be back here to the commentary. Greg, thank you for uh, your wonderful insight as always. Thank you. We'll talk to you, everybody, then. For Nick Hausman and Gregory Iron, this has been Black Label Pro's Darkest Timeline Championship Tournament 2. We'll talk to you next time. Whoop, whoop. Goodbye.